Hey everyone, so today I thought I would just do a little short video and let you guys know what's been going on with husband and I. I feel like I am always trying to come up with the next idea for my next video when really I think that maybe I should just have a little one-on-one -on -one chat with you guys. Um, I know that family and friends, a lot of them live far away from us, so I thought I would just give you guys like a video update of what we've been doing lately. So where should I start? We're busy. Shocker. I guess when I got married, I thought life was going to slow down and I wasn't going to be as busy, but that seems to not be the case. And we have a ton of stuff going on. Our back patio is currently being dug up because um, we're having some water problems and our kitchen is in the process of being remodeled. We have grout and paint left to do so once that is completely finished I'll hopefully be putting up a video and showing you guys that process that we did or that Kyle did. Let's be honest he did most of the work. Um, we're both working. Kyle's working full-time. I am working part-time but I am picking up hours at a couple other places so that is keeping me on my toes we have, for those who I guess I haven't talked to back home in a while, we have found a church down here that we've been attending. Um, it's Bethel Presbyterian. We love it. We have we try to go to Sunday school when we're home. And the friends that we have made there so far have just been such an encouragement and we're having a lot of fun with it. The pastor seems to really know, you know, know the word. And for all of you back home who are like, oh, Rachel's going to a Presbyterian church. They, this church has broken off of the, I guess, like fundamental or traditional Presbyterian church, I guess. So it's not quite what you guys are thinking. But I'm just, we're just really blessed to, um, you know, be able to attend this church. They do have a young marrieds group that meets about once a month and we have really enjoyed that. We really enjoy that. We look forward to that every month. So that's what's been going on there. For those of you who know that I hurt my silly little toe, I'm currently in physical therapy for that. So hopefully it'll get better. Uh, let's see. So little Miss Daisy is having a ball down here for those who may have known or may not have known. She did have some adjustment problems when we first moved down here, but she seems to be doing really well now. She um, enjoys going to the dog park and she seems to really like our neighbor Dee. So that is just, I'm very thankful for that. We do live in a neighborhood that does have a lot of other dogs and um, thankfully we do have some grass even though we live in a condo, so I'm thankful for that. But um, so she is doing good. We, we will be having a roommate staying with us this summer. So that'll be different but exciting. And I'm really glad. Um, he's a close friend of Kyle's. So I'm really glad that Kyle will, um, you know, have someone to hang out with this summer. So um, he can, Kyle can drag him to the gym instead of me. <laughs> so um, let's see. We're just living our life to the fullest, I guess, or living our life to the busiest. I feel like there's always something going on, um, which is crazy because I think it's just the two of us. How, how in the world do we have something going on all the time? But we do. Oh, I also think that it's safe to say that we have found the best Chinese restaurant in our little area. I'm sure there are a hundred million other Chinese restaurants throughout Columbus and Dublin and Reynoldsburg and all those other places, but I think that in our little, like, I don't know, five mile radius, we have found the best Chinese restaurant, which isn't essential for all of you Chinese lovers, so we are very thankful for that because nobody wants bad Chinese. I'm just saying. Let's see, what else is there? We can officially make it to and from church without using a GPS, so we're, I'm not good with like getting around downtown or anything yet. My friend Danae who lives down here, she's pretty good at it, um, but she probably goes out more than I do to be honest. So, but we're getting there. I mean, I can make it to work and I can make it to church, so I feel like that's what's important. As far as summer plans go, I'm just hoping to kind of not be so busy. Once our patio is done, we would like to just be able to grill out and invite our neighbors over and... Um, I hope that I get to spend a lot of time at the pool because our condo has a pool and 
Yeah, so there's a lot of different things that go on here in the summer, people have been telling us, so we're hopefully going to be able to go to some festivals and eat some carnival food and just enjoy um, our first summer here in our little condo. So yeah, I hope you guys feel like we just kind of sat down and had a cup of coffee together or had a couple cup of iced tea because it is so hot outside, which I'm so thankful for, and my sister-in-law is actually coming over here shortly and we are going to sit out in the grass and try and soak up some sun. So I hope you guys are all having a fantastic week and it's just about ready to be the weekend. So holler for that. And if you guys have any questions or comments or feel like I left something out that you guys had questions about, please let me know. I would love to maybe just sit down and do one of these, you know, every so many weeks and just give you guys an update on what we've been doing and how we are and what Daisy's been up to since we do you know not we don't really live close to family and friends I love you all and I miss you and I will see you guys later whether it's in person or in another video I'm on fire and bone to run. You looked at me and I was done. Just getting started. Just sold out all the floor seats. Take me to the trip. I like to go somewhere. Take me to New York. I like to see everything. I really want to come pick here with you. You'll be my American boy. He said, Hey, sister. It's really, really nice to meet ya. I just met this five for seven guy who's just my type. I like the way he's cheeking, his confidence is peaking. I like those baggy jeans, but I'ma like what's underneath them. New York all the way. I want a Sunday kind of love. I love to last past Saturday night. Oh, I'm not low. It's love at first sight. I want Sunday kind of love. Oh, yeah. Love is on the square And she seemed to find somebody Someone who cares Chilling on the third row Lay back swimming at the dope stones Smoke rolling out the window And ice cold beer sitting in the console then the rain up in the headlights It's got me reminiscing on them good times I'm turning off a real life drive And that's right, I'm hitting easy street and mud lives Leave my chores, place to go Load the truck up, hit the dirt road Change the doors, break the bird Pick the fire and call the girls King and the can and the Marlboro man Jack and Jill were a few good men We learned how to kiss a kiss a cock You better watch out for the boys in blue All this small town he said, she said And it funny how room spread Like y'all know something I don't know Man, this talk is getting old You better mind your business, man, watch your mouth For I knock that loud mouth out I'm tired of talking, man, you ain't listening You're